There is currently 12 JP players in the top 100 more than any other character. So I decided to spectate them. Here's to a fair fight. I am a professional. Street Fighter 6 is here and the Nerf series is back and the first video had to be on none other than JP. Now this video is going to be a bit different because I'm going to focus on spectating rather than my own gameplay. That's because, well, honestly, I don't really want to play JP. And secondly, because my Street Fighter gameplay right now is pretty trash. So what makes JP so strong? Well, we gotta start with his zoning and we gotta start with his clone move, which is basically his fireball. He's got three versions. It's actually a mix up. He's got an overhead, a low and a mid version. All three of them at full wait, screen wait, wait. is plus on block. If you get closer up though, it is negative, but at full screen it is plus 13 on block, which means it actually jails into his grounded projectile. If you block this move, you cannot move. This is what a lot of people, including diamond players, are getting wrong. His grounded projectile, however, is minus two, which means it's your turn. You should be able to dash after blocking this to get closer. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention he's got another special move, which is a full screen command grab. You have to jump this. Oh yes, and there is more. He's got this rift move which explodes after a few seconds. And if you block this, he is obviously plus. You gotta keep blocking, it's still his turn. On top of that, he can manually instantly explode it and this is still plus as well, plus 10. And of course, there is one more thing. He can actually teleport to this rift if he wants to. Basically, switching from zoning to full out attack. All these options together make his full screen game a complete nightmare. As for his neutral game, his heavy punch is his best button. It's got really good range, fairly quick as well, and he can special cancel it. And of course, one of his special moves is a quarter circle forward heavy punch, which is plus four on block. On top of that, on counter, hit it will combo to quickly summarize the rest he's got a full screen level three and a parry did i forget to mention he's level two which has four different hits including overheads and lows i think you guys get the picture okay now we're gonna spectate we're gonna spectate this chinese player who in my opinion is the best jp i've seen so far and he's up against this ken who's actually the rank one ken in the world rank three overall in the world this jp plays very different he plays far more aggressive so i thought it would be interesting to watch look at this he goes forward standing medium kick oh no but at the moment he's got off to a horrible start that is a problem and a perfect drive impact you can drive impact between the heavy punch and the special move it is very risky to do because if he doesn't cancel it 
just like that there's the heavy punch again but this time he doesn't cancel it so if ken went for the drive impact well he does it again this time he gets him and he's dead or almost dead another drive impact it's hard to react to those drive impacts this early on into the game Give it up, tools! Ah! look at the sweep by the way from jp it's got it's one of the best sweeps in the game i think there we go there's the teleport he uses the rift to teleport in this is what i'm talking about he plays so much more aggressive than other jp players are we gonna see it again the jump no uh. anti-air misses his throw and that is a great whiff punish on the throw miss there ap uh. misses a throw again and this time he's dead and now we're into the final round the problem is this ken has level three so we gotta watch out for that Ken right in there with he does have a level three here pressure again oh look at that hit confirm into the level three it's gonna do a ton of damage obviously and how does this jp make this comeback so playing it very slow this is gonna be an insane comeback there's the sweep look at the range on that sweep it's insane jump in big damage he's got one of the best jump in kicks in the game as well it's got really good hitbox look at that damage into the level one and now the zoning so the rift there it is and ken uses the drive rush to get out so that's what you guys got to do if you see that rift you can actually drive rush and get out of there as quick as possible but he still loses so here we go game number two i think is he going to continue to be aggressive look at that he plays a lot more aggressive than other jp players but this time it's costing him no don't do this oh that's he got to react to those drive impacts maybe he was trying to do something there another throw he is getting destroyed yeah is this going to be a perfect fantastic anti-air once again so the anti air is his down heavy punch oh he gets hit by the drive impact and he might be dead yeah look at this combo what is this combo from ken and that's a throw and once again ken takes round number one <laughs> you fool pokes again the sweep he loves his sweep he loves his sweep oh the jump kick it's gonna do a lot of damage especially with the drive rush there's a combo no level three Okay, drive rush. You can see how this Ken plays. To get out of the zoning, he uses drive rush to get right back in there. That is what you got to do. Oh, what a read from JP. And now corner, he might be dead Yeah, Let's check the look at the corner combo. He uses all his meter. If this hits, he's dead. He is dead. Final round here. Once again, using the drive rush. Ken not letting JP get any zoning uh, opportunities at all. Using his drive rush to just get in straight away. Oh, look at this. Double drive rush combo. So here we go. The zoning using the rift. And once again, straight away, drive rush. Anti. Oh, he uses the parry. It was the amplified parry. Look at this hit confirm or this conversion he's gotten from the rift. He might be dead here. Almost dead there into the level three. Nope. Oh, he's dead. He's dead. So on... Oki there he does the amplified rift and he just watches Ken okay here we go this time we're gonna be watching this player from Canada flux with over 31,000 LP he's gonna be up against a DJ player so let's see how this one turns out but straight away jump kick from DJ he does not want to get zoned out anti-air light light into hug. command grab it's very hard to react to and now DJ's full screen let's see how he's able to get out a triple dash to get out of there so the pressure dj definitely wants the pressure against jp here oh another command hug. grab light light into command grab so this guy likes to use his command grab on block it's very hard to react to there we go that's plus that's plus and he's using the fake as well i forgot to say this before but he can actually fake his fireball fight fight that's the fake fireball and I, it's gonna be very hard for dj to do anything out but he gets a jump kick i think was that a missed throw round number two okay there you can convert from there and that's plus okay that's not plus so he, he takes his turn there triple dash but there is a parry he uses the amplified version which is very very strong as well that's plus he has the zoning plus Look at the rift. It's so hard to deal with. He tries to jump. It was very risky to actually jump there. But now both of them are in burnout. I'm not sure who's better in burnout. I think JP's actually pretty good character in burnout. He doesn't lose too much. That's plus. Once again, has the block here. Oh, it's so annoying to deal with. And the... Oh, look at that. The level 3 on reaction. It's a full screen level 3. DJ tried to go with his uh, fireball, the double fireball. And this JP player reacts with the level 3. How does this start? Is he going to jump in again? No. Oh. 
Playing a lot more aggressive this time. That's plus. Uh, using the drive rush. So that's definitely the best way to get out of the zoning pressure from. Oh, fantastic. He goes with the drive impact. There is a gap there. Stupid. Oh, that could be a punish. Very nicely done from DJ. Another punish. Oh, he should have gone into level 2 there. He had the victory, I think. DJ had the win, but he didn't confirm into his level 2. Oh, no. This is very close. Very close. Look at the health bars. He's using his parry. Oh, he's in burnout now. Misses the... Ground it. Who won this? I don't know who won this. It's JP. Oh, that's good. He's dead. He's dead. Nerf JP, please.